What's up everybody? In this video, I will show you how I upgraded the RAM memory on my Lenovo laptop. I will also provide additional information towards the end of the video. This is the Lenovo ThinkPad E585. The laptop came with 8GB of RAM memory and I want to upgrade to 16GB. A memory upgrade will make the computer run faster when opening lots of programs or doing things like video editing. The first step is to find out the specifications of this laptop. I did a search for ThinkPad E585 specifications and I found this document that gives me the information that I need. Here in the memory section, we can see that this laptop has a maximum RAM capacity of 32 gigabytes. The speed of the memory chip is displayed in megahertz. The higher the number, the faster the memory. The maximum memory speed this laptop supports is 2400 megahertz. It is dual channel capable and it has two memory slots. What we want to do is identify if we have an open slot and find out the type of memory that it currently has. To open this laptop, I just need to loosen some screws on the bottom cover and use a prying tool to remove the cover. Here are the RAM memory slots. I see that one is used and one is open. Here are the specifications of this chip right here in the middle. Since we already have eight gigabytes, I just need to add another eight gigabyte chip in order to make a total of 16 gigabytes. Because this motherboard is dual channel capable, if we get a second identical chip, we will get a boost in performance versus using two different types of chips. I found the same memory on eBay for a good price. It arrived in the mail and it looks good. Here are both chips side to side. It is recommended to disconnect the laptop battery when you are installing the RAM chips. There's a notch that you need to match here. If it doesn't match, turn the chip around. Insert at an angle, press it in, then set it down and the clips on the sides will lock in place. Put everything back together and let's check if the computer recognizes the new RAM. Let's right click on the Windows icon, select system. Here we go, 16 gigabytes. The last step I recommend is to optimize your laptop's virtual memory. I have a video where I show you how to do that and I'll post a link to that in the video description. Let's talk about some additional information. One way you can find out your memory type and how many slots you have without having to open a laptop is to use CPU-Z. In this laptop, you can see that it has four slots and in this laptop, you can see that it has two slots. If I wanted the maximum performance out of my RAM memory, I would buy the chip that has the fastest speed that the motherboard supports. And then I would look at the latency. It is usually listed as a CL with a number. The smaller the CL number, the faster the chip. Once again, the fastest speed that your laptop supports with the smallest CL number you can find. If your laptop supports dual channel memory, buy your memory in pairs to get the best performance. If I wanted to upgrade to 32 gigabytes of RAM memory, I would use two of the same 16 gigabyte chips. If you buy two chips that have different speeds, the motherboard will run both at the slowest speed. You can buy memory chips with a faster speed than the maximum that your motherboard supports, but the laptop will limit the speed of the memory down to what it supports. So don't waste your money buying faster chips than what your motherboard supports. Lastly, when buying memory for your laptop, make sure it is the so dim type. The dim type is for desktops. So dim is for laptops. If this video was helpful, please give it a like and subscribe for more helpful content. I'll see you guys in the next video.